Status window has been unlocked. Artifact has been activated. Where? Am I? It feels like I'm deep in the water. You're the incarnation of Draka, the destroyer of worlds. What is this, Draka? The destroyer of worlds? What the hell is that? What's that? Is this a dream? No, it looks too vivid to be one. Wait, it looks like he is trying to say something. A few hours ago, Ignit Academy Training Hall. Next, Lou and Ardell. Yes, sir. As I explained before, you just have to cast Fireball and hit that Scarecrow. Heidel Combat Magic Professor. Fireball. A magic that any student of the Academy should be able to easily handle, but for someone incapable of magic like me. It is such a difficult task. Can I do it this time? Lewin, I said begin, right? Let's not give up. It might work this time, right? I'll do it at all costs. I'm gonna do it. Whoa, look at the size of his fireball. Is that amount of mana even possible for a human? Nice. If I keep going like this, I'll as you see. Damn it. Not again. No, please. I must hold on here. Uh, uh, Lewin, I can't. Hurry and release it. I, it won't leave my hand. Lewin, you're now a student of the graduating class. If you still can't handle such a simple magic like fireball, you won't pass the graduation test. You're destined to fail. That's right. I'm destined to fail. I apologize. I'll practice more. In this practical shooting test, we're supposed to create ten fireballs and hit the target multiple times. I, who can't even discharge magic, let alone hit a target, can never become a third-rate magician. How did such a good-for-nothing enter the academy as the best student in his class? I know, right. He better give up. Dunce of the academy. Since a humble local nobleman like me entered the academy as the valedictorian. It caused feelings of inferiority and jealousy among my peers who hailed from prestigious families, which became a sufficient reason for them to be hostile toward me. I could handle their bullying, but the reality that I had no more hope began to break me down from my very foundation. That is none other than the curse that has been shackling me down for the past six years, mana evocation disorder, although I had held up well until now. I began to frequently wonder, how long could I? Hold on in the future, Academy Corridor. How was the exam? Great, my, my, who do we have here? Isn't it the Dunsehead Lewin? Kikik. It's time to pack your bag, don't you think, if I were you? I'd be so embarrassed I wouldn't show up, but you're persevering. Do you know what the juniors call you, Dunsehead Lewin? Because of you, the standard of the graduating class has fallen. How about you just go back home now? Back to that rural territory of yours, ha ha ha. If you don't have skills, you should at least have money. I first heard about the Ardell family only after coming here. Ah, right, my father said this. They're just fools who act aloof despite having nothing. I can see the level of your family the moment I see. While he was saying that about his family, Lewin turned around and delivered a powerful punch to his face, causing blood to spurt from his mouth and making him fall to the ground. Try yapping once again. Our father what? You son of a bitch. How dare you? You should have known when to stop, Ben Folt. Who are you to mess with my father and my family? You bastard. Do you know who we are? As he rushed at him to punch, he instead received a powerful blow to his stomach, causing him to collapse to the ground. He knelt, clutching his stomach, with his head bowed and saliva dribbling from his mouth. You arrogant bastard! How dare you hit me, to think he's trying to use combat magic inside the academy. A trash with mana evocation disorder. Does he not care if he gets expelled? Die. He unleashed a powerful thunderbolt attack towards Lewin. I can't. Move my body. Would you stop at once? After hearing about their fight, Professor Heidel rushed there to stop them. But it was too late as Lewin had already been attacked by the thunderbolts. Shit. Like that, I thought everything was was over. You are the incarnation of Draka, the destroyer of worlds. Status window has been unlocked. Artifact player has been activated. What? What the hell is this? What's going on? What is happening, Del Lewin? Ardell, what? It was definitely my name, Lewin Ardell. Are you awake now? Helen, high-class healing magician. He opened his eyes. 
Where am I? The recovery room. It's okay. Keep lying no need to stand up. Okay. It's a little dizzy, but I can sit down. Did I? Pass out? What was that? It is still vivid. How long have I been passed out? Almost a day. It's fortunate that it wasn't worse. God helped you. Am I? All right now. We still have to check further. But you look too good for someone who was directly hit by a lightning bolt. There is no wound, burn, not even a damaged organ. I have never seen anything like this. What? Is this even possible? Lightning bolt is a scary magic that burns the entire body in a second. What's more, I took a direct blow. Why am I still perfectly fine? Excuse me for a moment. Since the professor is here, I will go look further into the results. Tell me right away if something goes weird. How are you feeling? I'm all right. That's fortunate. And there was a professor meeting about that incident. First, Ben Folt will be expelled. Use of offensive magic with strong intent. To kill, spreading false rumors about the Ardell family head, and the unfair treatment and bullying towards you. All these acts were considered to come up with this verdict. But I also hit Ben. Of course, there will be a punishment for you as well. Considering those fact, you will be doing the Academy's volunteer service for one month. Okay. Also, I want to ask you something. Do you perhaps have the artifact? What? Artifact? Of course not. If I had something like that, I wouldn't have been bullied like this. Well, judging by its worth and how rare it is, the family head of the Ardell family would have used it for his people already. But why are you asking me that? After hearing from Lewin that he doesn't have the artifact, Professor Heidel remained silent for a moment before starting to speak to him. I'm sure that a red light shrouded your body before the lightning bolt touched you. It seemed like a high-grade artifact was protecting you, which bounced off Ben's magic. What are you saying, artifact? What is he talking about? Wait, don't tell me. It's related to the dream I just had. No, what am I thinking? I don't understand what happened but I'm sure I don't have an artifact. Okay, then take some rest. I told him the truth that I have no idea what happened, but the professor didn't say anything more. What's he thinking? The experience that I had that can't be differentiated from a dream, and that strange voice, artifact Draka, the destroyer of the world, and player. I think there was one more thing. Um, it was status window. When he said status window... A window suddenly appeared before him, startling him. What the hell? It was real. Lewin, are you alright? Are you not feeling well? No, it's not that. Do you see this too? This blue thing in front of me. What are you saying? Lewin, there is nothing there. Are you sure you are alright? No way. She really can't see it. Then this, incarnation of Draka, the destroyer of world, as a result of his pursuit for infinite strength. The magician Draka perished along with his world. For Draka, who from birth lacked the ability to evoke mana, strength was the origin of his power. Player, an artifact of Draka that can summon the status window and limitlessly increase one's power through quests. Strength, 150. Agility, 100. Wisdom, 1550. Can be only seen by me. I should make an excuse first. Never mind. I must have been mistaken. Ha ha. That wasn't funny. The result is perfectly normal too. You can go back to your dorms now. Okay, thank you. Today, I am perfectly normal even after getting hit by a lightning bolt. You are the incarnation of Draka, the destroyer of the world. The man with the red eye I met in the other space, and the status window only I can see. The status window I saw then. It definitely said that I'm the incarnation of Draka. Could it be that? The artifact of the magician called Draco was transferred to me, and another weird window showed up in front of me, Quest, since you have become a player. Connected to Draca, the destroyer of worlds, you need to train your body in preparation for your increase in strength. Punch, 0 out of 100, kick, 0 out of 100, spin kick, 0 out of 100, reward, strength 10. Reward, skills unlocked. Punching and kicking, huh? It's all related to strength. Dot. How is this going to help a magician like me? But this isn't the time for suspecting it. I have to try it first. Punch. 1 out of 100. Punch. 2 out of 100. Good. The number is increasing. 
At this rate, I'm soon going to reach the goal. Punch. Two out of one hundred. Hmm. The number didn't increase this time. I guess it isn't considered a success with even a slight mistake. Okay then, let's do this properly. Finally, I'm done. The quest has been completed. Assigning rewards. Strength 10. Skills has been unlocked. Reward? What is this? Uh, what is this feeling? It's faintly coursing through my blood vessels. It's something more fundamental than mana. Yes, right. This feeling, I have, really gotten stronger. Then, let's see. The strength that goes into the magic has gotten way stronger. The speed, air resistance, and destructive power. Everything has definitely changed from before. My fundamental strength has really gotten stronger. Then, what's the other reward called skill unlock? Status window dot. Passive. Replaces mana with strength. Mana circles will be replaced by force circles. From now on, all magic will be affected by the player's strength. From now on, all movement of the player will be affected by strength. Replaces mana circles with force circles? Then does that mean my mana will be replaced by strength? All those who feel and study mana have a circle around the heart. The mana circle plays an important role in releasing and strengthening mana. Increases in number depending on the depth of mana and the amount of mana the magician can control. I had. For mana circles. It's way more than other kids of my age have. But because of my disability, it was like having none. The mana circle really disappeared. Then this strength that's revolving crazily in its stead is. The force circle, a force circle instead of a mana circle. There can be no magician without a Mu-Alpha-Nu-Alpha Mu -alpha circle. If this new circle can't do what the mana circle can, what would happen to me, then? Will my life as a magician end like this? No, it's too early to feel down. Let's test it first. Fireball. It's really fast. How can it be? And it's strong too. The moment I saw the size of my fireball, this, I realized is the power of an artifact. 